All the children raced to the cafeteria waiting to get to the delicious fish sauce. You hear a sizzle sizzle of the spring rolls on the frying pan. Slurp, slurp. Teachers are slurping the fishy, sweet, sour, fresh, tangy fish sauce. Fish sauce has been used for so many years with traditional Vietnamese food. Kids, teachers, and principals can't get over the delicious taste. The fish sauce is the best in the world. People eat it all of the time. Every time they have rice, they have fish sauce. Every time they have spring rolls, they have fish sauce. Every time they have beef, they have fish sauce. Well, you get the idea. Welcome to the wonderful world of fish sauce. Nhưng mà riêng cái nghề nước mắm thì không ai biết cái ông tổ nghề là như thế nào. Mà tại vì đất nước của Việt Nam mình đang là trải dài, tất cả đều dọc vào biển hết. Thì cái nguồn gốc của nước mắm từ xa xưa là do cái nguồn cá của mình khi mà đánh bắt nó rất là dồi dào, rất là nhiều. Thì khi đó là ta ăn không có hết, thì người ta mới người dân gian của mình ngày xưa mới nghĩ ra được cái vấn đề là mình bỏ muối vào đó để bảo quản cái con cá đó nhưng mà trong quá trình nó quá nhiều đi bỏ muối vô thì thời gian nó ra cái nước cái nước màu đỏ thì người ta thấy ăn cái nước màu đỏ là ngon thì đầu tiên người ta gọi là nước cá à, thì sau này từ từ cái chữ cá đó bắt đầu mới có chữ mắm thì mới là gọi là cái nước mắm No one actually knows who invented fish sauce The legend goes that some fishermen put salt on the fish to preserve it. The salt caused a dark red juice that came out. At first, the fishermen thought it was seawater, but then it became fish sauce. Even though we don't know where fish sauce originated, we do know that Foucault has the most famous fish sauce, and it takes 10 to 12 months to make this famous. Even though it seems like fish sauce should be a sustainable part of Vietnamese culture, It has a couple of threats. One threat is water pollution. Some of the water sources in Vietnam are dirty. These rivers and oceans are full of trash. However, water pollution is not as big of a threat as overfishing. Overfishing is when fishermen catch way too many fish. Vietnamese fishermen are overfishing the waterways. This is dramatically reducing the fish population that is used to make fish sauce in Vietnam. So that's a big problem because fish and salt are the main ingredients in fish sauce. Fish sauce is very important to Vietnamese culture because it makes Vietnamese food special. We want to make sure that we can keep this special sauce around for a long time. We can put trash cans on the beaches because people often litter there. If we make other people aware of overfishing, they might ask the government to make a law about overfishing. Then fish sauce will be sustainable for many more years to come.